see ip uh, if i may say when i started practicing in ip the two fields which were really uh, prevalent were trademarks which were almost like 90% of the work and copyright which was 10 15 20% copyright and designs i remember in the delhi high court when uh, in the initial uh, in the 90s even till 2000s there were hardly any uh, patent matters in the high court and most of the trademark matters used to be like a big company versus a small trader a small you know a uh, shopkeeper but after, from 92 to if i may just say maybe take a decade down the line the entire uh, you know uh, scene quite be completely changed we moved from a big multinational versus a small company versus a small trader versus a small keep, shopkeeper to very contested ip matter sometime early 2000s and thereafter so it's been about 15 years or maybe even just about 15 years or so where ip is no longer trademark versus counterfeit kind of issue but has become extremely complex it has become quite interesting quite deep and indian jurisprudence i must say is so uh, uh, developed right now that on most issues i don't think we even look need to look at international jurisprudence this never used to be the case in the early early years of my practice and uh, even the uh, kind of opportunities that they were in ip were uh, very little at that time uh, mainly you would have litigation or you would have you know some lawyers who would do trademark registration work but now if you see ip has grown into for example uh, licensing issues assignment issues broadcasting issues policy issues um, uh there is huge amount of uh diversity in ip and most companies you would be very surprised in the early years they would most companies would just have one legal manager who would be dealing with a trademark matter but today most companies have ip cells of their own so i mean we we moved to a completely different ecosystem in ip and i think uh, the growth in ip you know always uh, is directly proportionate to the growth in the economy and in the industry so i think when i joined came back from cambridge that was when india liberalized its economy 91 92 and the next decade saw the growth in the economy and growth in ip and it, it's just been uphill after that i mean uh, the graph has just risen and uh, today we deal with the most complex ip matters